Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In today's tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create a beautiful command prompt based menu for any batch script based program you want to develop. Let's take a quick look at the end product. You can design your menu for anything you need. Today we'll create a menu with numbered options that allows you to select and copy login credentials for Valorant directly to your clipboard. Let's get started. First, create a text file and name it to your liking. Then, change the file extension from .txt to .bat. Next, open the batch file and get ready to begin. We'll set up a few functions to enhance the user experience. First, we'll define the title of the command prompt window. For this video, I'm calling it Valorant Account Picker. We'll also set the size of the window for better readability. To keep the output clean, we'll use it echo off to prevent commands used for formatting from being displayed. Finally, we'll set the default text color for a more polished look. Most importantly, we'll write a function to allow us to use ASCII text in the command prompt window to create our logo giving your menu a bit of personality. Now let's write a logo function so we can call it with the call command instead of having to recreate it every time. The website I used to create the ASCII text will be linked in the description below. You can call your logo whatever you want for today. Mine is valo.acc. We'll use a series of echo commands with special characters to display the logo within the command prompt window. Now that we have our valo.acc function defined, let's call it to display our logo in the command prompt window. We'll follow it up with a pause command. This will temporarily halt the execution of the script and keep the command prompt window open until a key is pressed. Let's take our logo to the next level and add some color. Batch scripts allow us to use color codes to change the appearance of text within our logo function. Now, let's specifically change the color of the logo's text outlines. I'm going with white to make the light red pop, creating a more visually appealing contrast. Now let's do the other outline characters to finish the look. Oh, 
Now that we have the basic structure, let's apply the options our user can select from in the menu. Let's see how it looks. Okay, now let's make our function to copy our login credentials to the clipboard. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did and would like to see more videos from me in different areas of coding, please make sure to drop a like and be sure to subscribe so you don't lose me. If you need any help, add me on Discord. I'm always willing to help.